Today, we joined a free shopping tour to Playa del Carmen. We were dropped off at an overpriced tequila store. Followed by an even pricier jewelry store. They showcase how to make the jewelry. They did have nice artwork there. But most jewelry were horrendously overpriced. We arrived at Playa 90 minutes later. The bus dropped us off right at the beach. It was a two-block walk to 5th Avenue. We were given two hours to shop before the bus picked us up again. Playa has changed a lot. Big modern shopping malls are lined up along 5th Avenue. But there were still some souvenir shops that offered great prices. We found some great deals on souvenirs. Would we recommend this free shopping tour? Probably not. The high pressure sales at the jewelry store at the beginning was very off-putting. The better way is to walk to the Serenis main gate and wait for the Colectivo bus. It costs 40 pesos per person and it stops at the Colectivo station in Playa. Two hours shopping at the 5th Avenue was more than enough for us. It was getting very hot. And we were more than ready to head back to the Lazy River at the Grand Serenis. The coffee shop. All the restaurants are over here, the a la carte. Right now I'm going to pick up my pizza that I order. Every room I can order two pizza. So since we came back from the free tour and it's late, all the buffets are closed. I just ordered uh, two pizzas to go. The pizzas were delicious. We decided to visit the coastal temple Kaleta Zaak. It's located right at the main beach. To get to it, we had to cross this shallow section. The seaweed here was not too bad.
It is recommended you wear water shoes. It was very slippery going up. Choke. Some stones here. So we're going on this uh, little island. It has a Mayan ruins on it. This pre-Hispanic temple was built to worship the God of the Sun. It was also used as a coastal way marker for the Hispanic merchants, bringing goods from South America to the Gulf of Mexico. Constructed on a rocky hill, it was built to last for centuries. This spot was perfect for sunrise or wedding photos. No matter what fabulous places we visit, we don't feel like we are on vacation unless standing in front of the ocean. There's nothing more beautiful than a cool breeze and the crashing of the waves. Seeing this brings joy to our souls. Stop dreaming about your bucket list and start living it. A vacation dream come true. For dinner, we chose the Mediterranean restaurant. This restaurant was our favorite so far. The food was exceptionally tasty. A well-prepared meal with great presentation and an interesting flavor we have never experienced before. Wow, this food was amazing! So, thanks for watching! Please like, subscribe, and comment down below! See you next time!